and welcome back to The Sims 4 Realm of Magic. I feel so bad for Tiarantine because everyone is disgusted with her. Alanard is disgusted with her, he's leaving home. <laughs> we have Colin who's disgusted with her, he's outside. And I've also, guys, discovered the ugly truth of the puddles. So, Tiarantine was inside with Cartelia, kind of minding her own business and chatting each other up. And then out of nowhere, I noticed that the boys were having a bubble over their heads that was kind of like um, Tiarantine crossed out, so they were disgusted with her. And then when I jumped over to Cartelia, she threw up. She gagged after looking at Tiarantine, and then she threw up. And this is not the result of any wraith. That is the disgust that Cartelia has for Tiarantine. How sad is that? I feel absolutely terrible for her, but I don't know what to do. How do I get rid of this curse? I have no flipping clue. So we're just gonna get, yep, I know you hate it, but you have to mop it up because that is just mean as can be. Um, as for Colin, he's inside, but I thought that maybe he would want to go out. Oh look, Alan found some stuff out around outside. And he, don't go back home. He is actually really exhausted because he hasn't been able to sleep for a long time. That wraith has been chasing him and I think he still has that wraith in his mind. So he's been unable to get any rest. I'm gonna send him back home actually. Um, he can go grab himself. Are you using the, the you are going to go use, yep, yeah, okay. He can grab himself some food, so I'll get some leftovers, and while he eats, I'll sell the stuff that he has collected, because we are trying to save up for a cauldron. Our fates are going to change once we have that cauldron, but we need to save up for it in the first place. So he is selling bits and pieces, trying to make money here and there, helping out on the place. Colin is going to help out as well once he goes ahead and... Let's see. Oh, you, you're done. Okay, he seems to be able to just pass his bladder without even sitting on the toilet. It's pretty amazing. This isn't the first time he's done so. <laughs> okay, well, could you duel with... You could for stuff. Interesting. Well, if I duel for artifacts, I doubt I'm going to be able to sell anything. But maybe you should challenge her to a duel. So I'm going to get him to challenge her to a duel for artifacts. And he is sick now. Great. Well, hopefully you're able to get something from her. And if it's a better artifact than what you have in terms of either broom or wand, then maybe you can go ahead and... Yeah, the other thing is we don't have bills yet. Yet. We don't have bills yet. But if we do get bills, all the money we're saving up is going to go down the drain anyways. Huh. So we're kind of in a rush against time. But Colin... Do you not want to duel her? I thought you guys were going to duel each other. For magic artifacts, weren't you? Apparently not. Oh, come on. Come on, do you not want to duel each other? For artifacts, go on. I mean, Colin lost a duel against someone who is younger than him. Uh, not younger, but someone who is less experienced than him. So I don't even know if he can go ahead and do do anything or get a proper, you know... Yeah, I don't even know if he can go ahead and win anything. But if I, but this might count as good experience, so I'm, I'm willing to let him lose. Let's go ahead. Is, is she gonna come outside? No? 
If you're not gonna come outside, let me know because we have other things to do, woman. Come on. Let's go. Is she afraid? We don't have a charm, just isn't budging. There we go, now she's gonna duel with us. Come on, Colin, come on. You can do it. And oh my goodness, Tiarantine, what are you doing? We need money. We need this money. She's over here skipping work and we need money. How could you? I can't believe you, woman. You lost an hour's worth of pay. You lost 44 simoleons. Probably more, because it's an hour's worth of pay. My goodness, I am so upset at her. Let's see what they need to get an upgrade on their work. Hmm, Carla needs more charisma skill. Alana doesn't need anything. And, oh, Cartelia needs mixology skill. Okay, well, maybe I should start sending Cartelia over to Brindleton Bay, where we actually have the Salty Paws Saloon, and she can get her mixology skill up there. Maybe I should... Colin is fine. Did he lose? He lost, didn't he? Of course he did. did. Why does that not surprise me? And the Wraith is back. The Wraith is back. Alanon has not been able to sleep for days. I feel so bad for him. He hasn't been able to sleep for days. Well, why don't you... <laughs> and Cartelia, she keeps throwing up and cleaning up after herself. Okay, Alanon, here's what we're going to do. You are going to um, tend to your needs, and then we are going to leave the house because the house doesn't seem to be doing the best for you. We are going to go out and see if we can fish. And the reason we want to fish... Where is it? There was a... I swear there was a fishing spot somewhere here. Hmm. I think there's a fishing spot here. There we go. Now the reason we want to fish... Got wild sage. Hmm. Maybe we should harvest all this and sell that. But the reason we want to fish is because Tiarantine actually has a... Is he? I don't think he's, he's not, well, relatively close to Tiarantine, but actually, Tiarantine has a fish bowl up here that doesn't have a fish in it. And I think Alanard, since he's the merman, it makes sense that he's going to go find a fish as a thank you to Tiarantine. And also, I think maybe he's hoping that if he presents her with a gift, since she's the one who inadvertently gave him this curse, she's going to try and cook up something that's going to fix all of this. So I think that's what he's hoping. With that in mind, he's over here to come up with a present for Tiarantine. Please the witch, so that she gets rid of this wraith that's been following him around. And it's not out here, it seems to only follow him when he's on his home lot. So, there we go, he is trying to escape this thing. Cartelia? Oh, Alfaba, thank you, thank you, thank you, but I, I don't, don't think we're gonna, we're gonna go anywhere tonight. I'm sorry, but I don't think we're going to. Is there any? Actually, they can just go to the local bar. I'm sure they'll be able to find something there. And who's this? Oh look, it's Keith Fowler. We tend to drink from him a lot, quite frequently. <laughs> she's gonna go grab a drink from him, so she's out to hunt. It is nighttime. Oh, he caught a perch. How fascinating. If you could catch something a little bit more interesting, I think it would work better. But if a perch is all you have, then well, yeah, if a perch is all you have, I guess a perch is what she's going to get. <laughs> I'll sell it, though, because it's extra money. If nothing else, it's extra money. I hope he does find something better, <laughs> though. But let's see what everyone wants to do. He wants to cloud gaze with Cartelia. Okay, that makes sense. He wants to... You're not sick anymore, though. Analyze a book. We can deal with that. 131 simoleons. Okay, good. And Cartelia wants to get to know Colin. And Tiarantine also wants to chat with Colin. Okay, sweet. Well, you've had your drink. Have you? How did you not drink anything? Ugh. She got, yeah, she let him get away. No, go, go get him, go get him. Don't get distracted like that. Go get him, and I think since we are trying to focus on money, I am probably going to get Cartelia and Colin. 
Hmm. Maybe everyone. I'll just take everyone with me to the bar, the local bar, and then we can see what we get done there. Oh, she's a minor vampire. Nice. Well, she's got a bunch of points now. Let's see what we can give her in terms of points. Um, we have bat form. We don't really need this garlic immunity. We're not really near people um, for that. Cast hallucination. I don't know what we could use that for. Like, it can make another sim talk to themselves, but what, does that help with something? Huh. I don't know. I've never really used that power, though, so I am intrigued by it. I'm gonna get it, just because I've never used it before. But we need to take on a weakness as well, don't we? Hmm, guilty drinker, withered stomach, sloppy drinker. I don't mind her having the withered stomach, I'll go with that because she never eats normal food anyways, even if she does cook for everyone. Although that is supposed to be Alan Art's thing, he is the foodie. But you know what, I'm actually gonna grab everyone. And we are gonna head on over to the local bar. So let's go to this spot over here, visit the bar. And you know what, let's invite Morgan Amber. Yeah, everyone loves him. Alan at Aquasnap, Colin, Tiarantine, and Angolin. Why not? We'll invite Angolin as well. And we'll all head over, start working on our skills for work, because getting promoted is going to be a good thing for us. More money for less hours, of course. I'm pretty sure that you could also go ahead and do freelance work, I think, because that did come with... Um, Mm, but it's just easier to have like a regular source of work. Okay, let's see. Let's see, shall we? You need to work on mixology, don't you? So let's practice making drinks at the bar. Tiarantine, you need... You, okay, you are fine. You are fine. Colin's the one who needs charisma. But you guys wanted to talk to him, didn't you? Mm. You want to chat with Colin, so let's go chat with him. Let's brighten his day, and then let's also, once you're done, we'll get Colin, or we'll get Alanad to stargaze, I think? No, cloud gaze with Cartelia. Well, it's the night time, we can't cloud, with, cloud gaze with her just yet, but she's having a good chat with Morgan, that's quite nice, but you, you shouldn't be chatting, you should be practicing drinks. Come on, let's go. She needs to practice mixology. So there we go, we can come to the local bar to get that done. That's, that's, that's pretty nice. Oh, come on. Can you not? Can you not? She's taking the space. Can you tend the bar? Will that get your skill up if you tend the bar? I don't know. I think only one sim can tend the bar at a time. Yeah, and currently, Courtney Blackwell is the mixologist. She can't tend, but I think we should be able to put in an extra bar. So we're gonna do that. I'm gonna put in another mixology table in here so that she can also get a chance to play around with this. And I like this one. This one looks nice. So we'll put one... Let's see, do we really need this over here? Hmm. Where to put it? Where to put it? Uh, you know what? We don't need this. Actually, we we can just... Yeah, we'll pop it over here. That's fine. Pop it over there. We'll get the bar in this corner. Or should we move the bar? That seems about fine. There we go, that, it feels a little bit too close to the, uh, yeah, fireplace. Can we put it sideways? We could put it sideways. That still feels kind of dangerous though. Hmm. Well, I am just going to do this. That feels a lot safer. 
in my opinion. So there we go, we have another bar back here and I'll get her to practice making drinks over there. So you don't have to disturb anyone and no one has to disturb you, but you can work on that. There we go, and we'll just leave her to it. She can get her skills up. And you didn't talk to Colin, did you? I told you to get to know Colin. Colin, can we please get to know you while we make drinks? Can we multitask? I don't know, I think we can. Maybe we can't. Yeah, probably not when you're making drinks. Hmm. That's fine, I guess. Oh no, you can. Okay, wonderful. Nice, 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 nice. So they'll just chat with each other. She'll get to know him a little bit. And Eleanor wants to cloud gaze, but it is not the morning. Wait, you can't cloud gaze with her. You'll kill her, you idiot. That's my fault. I didn't think about it. He wants to catch a fish, though. And he doesn't really need to do anything. So, I might just send him out again. He can just go by the river and try and catch a fish, I guess. He can work on that without any problem. I think that that is the goal for him to work on that without a problem. So he's just going to come down this way and go fishing. There we go. So it seems as though because of his curse, his energy is not going down any more than it already is, but it's not going up either. Okay, he's off to do his own thing. Colin, you need to chat with someone. Is he dancing? He's dancing. You need to get your, you need to chat. And is Morgan over here? Morgan, I think, has come and gone. Hmm. Well, what about El Faba? You can invite her to dance and you can chat with her as well. Invite to teach dancing. I don't know how she's gonna take that. El Fala, would you like to dance with us, maybe? Okay, there we go, she's dancing. She's dancing. Let's, uh... Let's, let's see. Hmm. Discuss latest book. Yes, any magical domes you might have seen, perhaps, in the magic realm? Yes, no, maybe. Does anyone have any extra points for us to use? Nope, I don't think so. We've used up all the points we have. I don't know if it's because we don't use a lot of magic, but I feel as though it's very difficult to get points for the witches. Like for the spellcasters. Is it just me? It might just be me, but I feel as though it is a little bit more difficult. And how is his charisma going? His charisma is going up very slowly. Let's enthuse about vampires. 23% complete. Hmm. It is going up very, very slowly. Very small pace. Um, talk about potion mishaps. Actually, no. Mm. Ah, well, yeah. And those about magic. Let's discuss overcharge risks. Yeah, that is going up very, very slowly. Very slowly. I guess because it's not too social of a person. But that's okay. That's something to work on over time. I guess he, they do have a mirror at home and he could work on um, social skills that way as well. But let's, yeah, show off your muscles, which I, you, I didn't know you had muscles. Do you have muscles, sir? I did not know you had muscles, but apparently do. Oh, Morgan! 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 Morgan, hi! Hi, Morgan! I wanna, I wanna uh, discuss things with you, please. Please, I wanna just be in your presence. I want to be in your presence. Well, let's discuss interests. Did I just do that? Yeah, I think I selected interests twice. Who cares? Let's go talk with Morgan. Let's go. Okay, we've invited Morgan, who is angry for some reason. Uh, Morgan, you're really cool. Please be our friend. I think we're already friends, but like... Oh, what? The fish are too elusive. Don't worry. Let's share ideas. We're gonna come and help you out. And by help, I mean we're gonna set you right back to it. I don't wanna use your aquatic lure because I don't want you to run out of hydration um, while you're in the middle of nowhere. Even though we have water here, I doubt you can just jump into it and hydrate yourself, so let's not go that far. He's gonna keep trying though, because if the, the fish here are harder to catch, maybe they're a bit more valuable. <sighs> okay. 
think about it, dude. You need a good present. You need a good present to give to TR and Teen. Especially after you made that face and thought that she was ugly. I don't think she's gonna be in a good mood, okay? So you need to try your best. And I think he's, he's doing that. <laughs> he's trying. Oh my goodness. Everyone just wants to talk with, with Colin. She wants to chat with Colin. Then go chat with him. Gossip with him. And she wants to get to know Colin. Didn't I tell you to get to know him? That's your problem if you haven't been socializing with him. I gave you clear cues. Um, doesn't say get to know anywhere. I might have already gone through it. Well, I guess you can discuss interests with him, if possible. Damn, Colin, you're very popular. Everyone just wants to talk to you. Oh no, the curse is back. The curse is back. Yeah, everyone just wants to talk with Colin, and Colin's just interested in analyzing books. Anyways, guys, with that said and done, I'm going to leave off here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.